but yeah, so we'll get going here. Uh, basically, what we're going to do is have a little bit of a contest. Uh, I think we'll make it a Mother's Day contest, since Mother's Day is just over a month away. Um, as most of you know, if you've been following along uh, on my Facebook feed, Instagram feed, all that sort of stuff, I draw a lot of comics. Here's this, this one here is the, the latest one I did, a little Madonna one that I did uh -oh, not too long ago um, on my little clipboard there. And I've been doing it for a little while, so I got quite a few. So I'll see if you'll I'll bear with me for a second. I'll tilt you down here. And that's still a secret for later, so I'll hide that. But um, as you can see here, this is my binder of all my comics. So it's been a couple of years. So I have uh, accumulated a few. <laughs> I've been drawing these for about two or three years now. So I've got quite a few of them all saved up in here, all different kinds. This is one of the first ones I did after we came back from uh, the first Remax R4 I went to. And they're all in the big book, in the big binder here. Uh, so we just keep making them every day. And a lot of them get attention. So uh, I've had people over the years uh, ask me uh, if they could have copies of them, if they could have them and stuff. And I have given a few away. So let me just get that straightened up there. Uh, there's a bunch of them that I've actually given away. Some of them were actually uh, to the people that the comics were about. So my friend Paul Hannon has one, Christina Croner has one, um, I can't think of who else has one that's actually about them. And a friend, my friend Jen O'Brien has one of the first drawings that I ever gave away recently anyways. She has it framed in her place there, little Jean Grey slash Phoenix. Uh, Jennifer Evelyn has one, Mo Vacherez has my uh, Jimi Hendrix drawing out in Ottawa. Uh, Christine Kemp has one, and... A couple other ones kicking around here and there. It's kind of weird because I do give them away. Some of them I gave away and people went and framed them on their own. So I figured once I started giving them away, I guess I might as well go and frame them myself. So I usually go out and I get this nice white gallery frame. And I put them in this nice frame and then I hand them out to people and stuff. And it's really weird when you're walking into uh, somebody's house. And I don't know if any of you have ever experienced this before. It's not a common thing, I guess. But it's weird for me to walk into somebody's house and see my own artwork there. So I've walked into other people's houses where I've given away a comic strip, uh, except usually about them. So I know if I go to Paul Hannon's office, he's got a framed copy of the comic that I drew about him hanging in his office. And it's weird for me to walk into people's places and see stuff that I did hanging on their walls. Uh, I've got other people's artwork hanging on my walls, and uh, it's just an odd feeling. I, I always get a little bit weirded out when I see that kind of stuff. Hey, Loretta's here, Season's here, John from Ireland is here. Good to see you, bro. Um... So I give, I've given away a lot of my own artwork and stuff like that. People have asked me for them over the years. And they framed them, put them on their walls, like I've been saying. And uh, I figured, let's have a contest. So I put my, probably my most popular one that I've ever done. Uh, I framed it up here for, I'm going to give it away for free. So I'll let you have a look. This is the one that I'll be giving away. It's Wonder Woman. So this is probably the, the most popular one, or one of the most popular ones that I've ever given away. So usually when I post this one or repost this one, um, I get a lot of likes and comments and all that sort of stuff. So everybody really seems to like this one. So it's all framed. It's all ready to hang. It's got little hangers on the back and everything like that. It's a very nice gallery frame just set up to show it off. So this is the contest that we're going to have. Since it is Wonder Woman and it is about being an amazing woman and taking charge and ruling the world and all that kind of stuff, I'm going to give this away for free. Now you can be anybody. You can be a man, you can be a woman, you can be pretty much anywhere in the world. So I will ship this to you if you're in Ireland, John, or if you're in the United States, if you're in Europe. Um, as long as it's somewhere reasonable that I can ship it to, that isn't going to cost me like $500 to ship to. And uh, they'll actually receive my shipment and I have reasonable expectation that it'll get there in one piece. Um, I will ship it to you for free, but you need to do something for me. So... What I would like to do um, is have this contest. And since it is Wonder Woman, like I mentioned, and we're making it somewhat of a Mother's Day contest, what I'd like you to do is tell me about an amazing woman in your life. Tell me about yourself if you think you're amazing. That's more than happy to listen to those stories as well. Uh, but you got to tell me the story. So you can write the story. You can do a video about the story. You can send me pictures. 
anything you want. It's the, the sky's the limit. There's no limits to what you can do or how you want to do it. You go ahead and choose, but tell me the story about an amazing woman or group of women that you know that you're personally connected to somehow. It doesn't have to be related or anything like that. It could be friends, could be an old teacher, it could be a boss or a mentor or somebody in your community, anybody. So as long as it's a, it's a woman, since it is Wonder Woman and we're talking about Mother's Day, um, but no sad stories. And I'll tell you why. Um, everybody at this point, myself included, um, has friends, family close to them who have suffered through illnesses, who have um, unfortunately passed due to illnesses, things like cancer uh, and that sort of thing. And the only reason I don't want to include those stories is because I'll never be able to choose. There's no way I'm ever going to be able to say that one person's story about their mother, sister, aunt, somebody like that suffering through cancer and coming through the other end is somehow more or less worthy of, of winning a contest or something like that. Um, they're all amazing stories um, and, and I have deep respect for the people who've been able to go through things like that and come out the other side and still be strong people and, and do all the things that they do, like taking care of families and working and all that sort of thing. But again, I'm never going to be able to decide which of those stories is quote unquote better than the other one. So let's keep it fun. Keep it fun, keep it funny, because funny I can decide. If you're not funny, you're not funny. If you're not interesting, you're not creative, I have no problem telling you that you're not interesting or creative. So let's keep it uh, interesting, fun, inspiring stories, all that kind of stuff. Um, but send it to me. So you can private message me here. Uh, you can email me at Tony at thegeekyagent.com. Uh, I'll be putting all this up later, so I'll be posting a YouTube version of this video. It'll have all the stuff here. But basically, it's Tony, that's me at the geeky agent which is also me dot com so send it there text me if you want some more information 289-237-9896 um we'll let it run till the end of april that way we have some time to actually package this up and get it sent to you before mother's day but basically again i'll pull up again so here's my little wonder woman comic it's all framed and nicely framed the glass frame ready to go um so tell me again like i said tell me about an amazing inspirational funny creative uh, woman or group of women in your life and tell me in a fun, creative way. Again, write me the story, send me some photos, do a video, uh, interview that person if you want or interview people that know that person. Do it, do it. just make it fun. Um, send it to me. Um, we'll find a way. If you've got a big video, you can send me a link through Dropbox or some other way. Um, I'll, I'll help you with that portion of it, but uh, contact me, Tony at thegeekyagent.com, private message me on Facebook, text me 289-237-9896, and uh, get started. I look forward to hearing all your stories. Here once again, there's Wonder Woman. Yay. It could be yours or for somebody that you really love, so let me know. I have this here waiting for you, all nicely taken care of. And as always, thanks for tuning in, guys. And I'll keep this nice and short, and I'll talk to you soon. Have a great day.